On the blue alliance side, we have three red ro blue robots moving, two red robots moving. 4485 first to take a switch. Same with 1741. 5010 able to take first blood on that scale. And thus, going into Teleop, very close match scores, but one red alliance having a, a lead, or sorry, not having a lead, but having a distinct advantage going into this match. 5188 looking to take back the scale from the Red Alliance. 4485 doing what they do best. Taking cubes and working them to their opponent switch. We have seen them employ this tactic all day long. Oh, instead they're actually taking it to the scale, making sure they hold it down. 3176 on to 5010 for a little bit. 90 seconds left of this match, and only a 10-point difference between the two teams. 1741 currently not moving. That leads 50-10, the, the lone Red Alliance robot. Want to go over there, start working their exchange. 4485 continuing to put cubes up on the scale, maintain that control even further. 5188 classified robotics. Starting to work the exchange over for the Blue Alliance. The exchange, once filled up with power cubes, can be used for different power-ups. One power-up just played now, the boost doubles the points on, both, on the scale on the switch for 20 seconds. You see it by the flashing lights. Thirty-one seventy-six placing another cube. 3176 and 4485 placing cubes on their Red Alliance switch. Unfortunately, 1741's mechanism holding down the Red Alliance switch. 4485 continuing to pile cubes on the Blue Alliance to scale along with 3176. With two seconds left in this match, we're going to end a very high score for the Blue Alliance. Now let's look up to our scoreboard for our final scores of that match. And the winners, the Blue Alliance. Blue Alliance scoring a high score for today's